guys, welcome to East PRA Coffee House and welcome to One Shot Espresso Reviews. I'm Mike Rizzo. Today we're trying one from the famous craft coffee producers, Brandywine Coffee. If you know anything about craft coffee in America, you probably recognize your kind of whimsical designs. They're very unique designs of these coffee bags. Brandywine Roasters, uh, one of the pioneers in craft roasting coffee. Uh, they are from Newark, Delaware. Um, excuse me. Wilmington, Delaware. Why did I think Newark, Delaware? Anyway, wow. <laughs> Long day at the shop. Hey, Wilmington, Delaware. Sorry, Brandywine. Wilmington, Delaware, Brandywine Coffee Roasters. Uh, this one is a Costa Rican naturally processed coffee. It's called La Lages. Um, they have a few from Costa Rica. Uh, they have a big selection of coffee on their website. This is a $25 bag, so the second most expensive bag of coffee I've ever purchased. Rolls of the show. I sip it. One shot i give you my raw feedback on how i like it this is a lighter roasted coffee natural process means this the coffee is the coffee berry is dried according to their website this particular farm dries the coffee for uh 22 to 27 days in the bean that typically makes for a sweeter coffee so if you're looking to buy coffee you like sweeter coffees natural or honey processed coffees uh, tend to be a little bit on the sweet side costa rica is an area of, the, area of the world that produces some really fruity coffees. Um, this one is, of course, made for, um, not an espresso blend, but made for drip coffee. Uh, this is probably a really good single origin drip coffee, at least I think it was. Now I'm gonna try it as an espresso. Now the pressure of the espresso machine sometimes makes different flavors come out. So it sometimes can be wildly different than a cup of the coffee on a pour over, or it can be just pretty much the same, just a little bit more intense. So we'll see which direction this goes. Again, this is Brandywine Coffee Roasters here on One Shot Espresso Reviews. From East BRI Coffee House, I'm Mike. Thanks for watching the program. I'm gonna tell you what I think of this one from Wilmington, Delaware. All right, guys, so the Costa Rican coffee from Brandywine has a good aroma to it. Like I said, it's a little bit of lighter roast. Of course, they're to they're t Tasting notes, cooked berry, cane sugar, pineapple. We'll see what I get here in this shot of espresso. Yeah, so it has a nice citrusy front to it. I liked it a lot. Uh, I can definitely taste kind of the cane sugar to it. Maybe pineapple at the end. I think a little bit of limey as well. You're not super light. I thought it might be a little bit lighter. Good juicy citrus flavors to it. Uh, pretty smooth, not incredibly smooth, but pretty smooth. A little bit of that classic bitterness of an espresso uh, on the finish, uh, a little bright to start. It's a pretty good coffee. I'd rate this one a pretty good espresso. Again, this is probably one you wanna try as a coffee. I'm crazy enough to put a $25 pour over coffee through my espresso machine, because why not? Anyway, Costa Rica, La Lages from Brandywine Coffee Roasters, Wilmington, Delaware, one shot espresso review. I rate this one about an 87. Pretty bright and juicy espresso. Uh, check it out. Talk to you guys soon. Make sure you subscribe.